that it is not to be. Everywhere in this community, it is okay, 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 okay. Why? Why? Who is it this time? Who else but Igwe Akataka? Igwe Akataka? Eh? Igwe Akataka kwa? What did he do to you, Papa? The Igwe has treated me with levity in this community. The Igwe doesn't like my face. He takes what belongs to me and gives it to Keke. Eh? This is not the first time. Neither is it the second. I don't understand, Papa. Why is he favoring him like that? Do I know? Maybe your okay, isn't trapped him with champs. champs. Eh? The first time I wanted to marry, the something happened. The something happened. Igwe, you must help me win the hand of Ne in marriage. She already is in love with Okeke. But I can give anything for me to. Winner's wife. I am not Nne. And she's not my daughter. If I have my way, I won't mind her as a wife. But you, you see, see but Igwe, she is very close to your family and to you in particular. You are in a position to, to convince her on my behalf. Name your price, Igwe. I can pay. If she has made up her mind for another man. Why don't you forget about her? Possibly look elsewhere for Just like that? No, now, Igwe. No. Unless you don't want to help me. Huh? Uh, there is nothing I can do. And you can't force her against her will. Oh, is that it? Akrika, my hands are tied. I see. And that was how I lost that woman. Because Igwe refused to support me. To further frustrate me, he gave Okeke the second in command of this Uzawa, a position I long desired, and honored him with the land at Washanta. Eh? Tell me, how can Okeke, that thing that looks as famine, represent Uzawa as second in command when people like us who are robust and lively are around? Let me tell you. Okeke will not use that land. Never. Never. But Papa, it has been given to him. What will he do? My son, there is nothing I cannot do. I can do anything. Let me advise you. Whatever you want in life, go for it. If anybody stands on your way, pull him down. But if possible, crush him. Crush him! Let me go and, uh, and see the Igwe. Move back, Akrika Choko. Move back, Akrika Choko. Uguma, where is your father going to? He's going to the Igwe's palace. For what? Today is not the council meeting. He's going to reverse the Igwe's decision for making Mazio Keke second in command and honoring him with the land at Ofianta. Your father can never give up on anything. I've told him to stop this Garagara life. He couldn't listen to me. I don't get it. Papa is a real man. He is. Like father, like son. Please don't forget to tell uh, 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 Keke. Okay, okay, that he will come down the pamphlet that is right at Olonto uh, for me. Okay, I won't, I, won't, I won't forget, Mama. Lola, no. no, no, may the peace of the Lord rest with you and your household. Thank you. Uh, I, I know you cannot remember my face, Lola. I am trying to. Okay. I am Pastor James, the son of Ibn Amen. I have been away for some time now on God's work and I have just returned to Zwaba to continue my work as a minister of the gospel. I see. You are welcome. 
Thank you. But uh, my husband, Igwe, is not available now. I see. Uh, Lola, I have only come to pay homage to the Igwe and his household. And of course, announce my return uh, to Zaba with the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, this is my wife, by name Ichoma. Lola, may the peace of the Lord rest with you and your household. You are both welcome to Zaba. Thank, Thank you. you. Our society is in dire need of God's touchdown. And this is where our services are needed. Very well, very well. Yeah. I'm glad to yeah. hear that. Thank you. I'm very glad that you know. Thank you. So once more, welcome. Thank I'll you. let you well know that you are here. Maybe he will invite you back. Oh, to the that would be very nice. Yeah. We'd be glad to come back. Thank you. It's okay. You're welcome once more. Mboye! Mboye! Um. Hey, my husband. Huh? Bring that one. Yeah. Right. Bring it to. Where is the pan wine, boy? Pour some for me. Pour for me. <clears throat> you didn't ask me about the land that I often. Hey! How did you go about it? <laughs> I got the Igwe to remove your keke. Good. In fact, the Igwe uprooted the keke, yes. getting land elsewhere. Ah? The land belongs to us now. No, I'm going to get you off. I'm going to get you off. Who can I show you? Hey. I know now, my husband. I'm very, very proud of you. Fire eater. Okay, no. Dazzler. Fire okay, consumer. Yeah. Fire on the mountain. Gentlemen. Yes. I expect all of us to work together for the development of this community. So, we must support one another. Igwe! May I raise the lock? I know. I've been waiting for a better opportunity to express my gratitude to you for your trust and confidence in me. Igwe, mm -hmm. I'm grateful. Thank you. I have also accepted my new position as your second in command. Thank you. And the piece of land given to me at uh, Kofianta. God no, bless you. Igwe, I want to show my appreciation. <laughs> Igwe! To the glory of God, small, small, they grew to become wives and mothers. Igwe, mm -hmm. may you live long? He said, Igwe, I want to ask. ask I want to ask. Ask Igwe. I can go ahead and ask your question. Is this why you brought us cabinet members to your palace to glorify your entities and discuss non issues? Okay, sit down. Eh? Sit down. Ah, okay, okay, what, uh, why are you nervous? 
Africa, thank God, sat down. Right. Say, don't waste your saliva. Soon, the fifth soup will be ready. You'll be part of it. Yeah. <laughs> Who? You are. Mula! Yes. But I got you open. <laughs> Do you want know what? The pepper soup, of course. Are you part of it? <laughs> this is an insult! So you have to look good all the time. <laughs> I know, Ne. You know you're my second mother. That's why I take very good care of you. <laughs> I know. Thank you. Okay, okay, the wife and other men walking inside the farm. Which okay, okay, when? Just now as I was coming back from the farm. I saw them with my own two naked eyes. Not on that land. Unless he doesn't want to leave. I'm doing. The land belongs to me and I'm working on it. Which land belongs to you? Okay, okay. Hmm? You are cutting real danger. You forget that I am danger personified. Danger? What kind of danger am I cutting? This land belongs to me and I am working on it. What danger are you talking about? The danger I'm talking about? Yes. You are saying it belongs to you? Of course, and I have no dispute with anybody over this piece of land. Okay, okay. Yes. If you love yourself, stay away from this land. Let me tell you, Akrika. This land was given to me by the community in its entirety. Right? So I don't know what you are talking about. Hey! Please leave my. Leave. Hey! Okay, okay. Uh -huh. We shall see. See what, Akrika? See what, Akrika? You only trying to ferment trouble. And if you come here again, I will command my boy to beat you up. Who am I going to you? It's okay, Jebe. I told you, Shibe, I got going. We shall see. What are we saying? Thank you. Hey! I see nothing. Okay, okay. Continue walking. Don't, don't we shall see. 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 We shall uh, you know that the Bible says, if you have any problem with your brother, you go to him and make it up with him. To so fair we one. should endeavor to live in peace with all. James, let me ask you. If a man plans to kill you, what yes. do you do? What do you do in this, in this Pentecost? What do you do? You should get a weapon and kill him before he kills you. Uh, no, 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 Master Krika. Master Krika. That's the devil's way of doing it. If you do it like that, you are a servant of the devil. God wants us to forgive and leave vengeance to him. Did I invite you to let me or hand to live in peace with my enemies? Don't, don't talk about devil again. Mazakreka, listen, listen to me, Mazakreka. Wait, Mazakreka. You see, God has called all men to repent of their sins and turn away from their evil way. You are not exempted from this call. In fact, anyone who rejects this call has succeeded in making one choice, hellfire. James, so you returned to Uzawa to torment Akrika? Eh? I said, don't refer me to hell again, no? 
uh, uh, ma, 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 wait, wait. What I am saying is that it does not pay to commit evil. Because God in heaven is watching us. Go to hell. James, go to hell. Go to hell. Don't preach to me your peace or your hell again. Go to hell. James, go to hell. If you ignore the call of our heavenly uh -huh. what will happen? You will cry had I known. Who, who will cry? If, if you don't take time, I'll give you worker now. I'll just give you worker. If you, if you ignore the call of our heavenly father, you will cry had I known. God have mercy on you. For you by servants. Mm. Cooking, washing of clothes, and even washing of plates. Yes. Yes. All you need to do is to make your request, and everybody goes. Everybody sets into motion to please the only daughter of the Igbo, oh. the princess of Ozawa. <laughs> See, Aku, it is not like that, okay? I work. See, I do work. But yes, not hard works, because my father would not hear that I did. Okay, that is what I'm talking about. Yes, you were born with the, with the proverbial silver spoon in your mouth. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Belle, <clears throat> have you forgotten that your father is the second in command to my father? Mm -hmm. And that makes you a princess. What? Yes. Princess, uh -huh. <laughs> a suffering princess. <laughs> no, my dear, a hard-working princess. And <laughs> one. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. You bought some yeah. for me. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Did you notice how? Akerika ignored me the other day I greeted him. Yes. Yes, I noticed. And, um, I wanted to ask if you had a quarrel with him. Quarrel? What sort of quarrel? No. At least, not that I know of. You know, Akerika is a very wicked man. He always has something up his sleeves. Who knows what wickedness is planning next? Oh, sometimes I wish such wicked people don't come to earth. Well, yeah. wishes were houses. <laughs> <laughs> Beggars were right. <laughs> yeah, so they say. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ne. Ne. Nein. <lacht> Where is that? She's cleaning the house. Uh, please, eh? Uh, make sure that you prepare the food for the people working for us at the farm on good time. Uh, uh. Uh, please, my dear, make sure that uh, the, you feed the goats well, well today. Because I'm sure that our poor and don't do what have been waiting for me at the farm. Yes. Then I will start immediately to prepare the food for the people. Please, like don't be late. Okay. My husband, I'm so scared about this dread. What about it? Okeke was killed with a machine by a cricket. And after killing Okeke, he went after his wife. And you, my lord. God forbid. It was only a dream. Don't forget that I'm the Igwe, and nobody can touch what belongs to me. Because my life and death is in the hand of God. I know, but I'm worried because you know that my dreams always come true. I know Akrika is evil and does virtually anything that comes to his mind. But touching me or anything that belongs to me will be far from whatever he will die. We must be very careful with him. Let's watch him carefully, please. Don't forget that Akrika is a member of this cabinet. And I will not stop him from attending cabinet meetings. My lord, I suggest that you suspend all cabinet meetings for now. Until you are sure of what is happening, please. But is that why you are crying anyway? <laughs> yes, because I don't want to lose you, please. Please, don't wash him. Please. Um, since we have finished the other portion of plant, Let's uh, do some job in this portion of land, right? And like I told you people, the meal will still be here. Oh, but man, me, I'm hungry. Don't worry, the food will be here. I instructed my family to bring food here in good time. Masi, yeah. see, without eating, this will not have strength to work. Cannot uh, you have to work, work first. What, uh, Ndo, sir, go over to that place. Uh, Apo, Masi, you face here. Hmm? Well, I go in there to see what I can do. Hmm? Okay.
mbakocho koma yali yali yazo mbakocho koma papa yazo mbakocho koma papa hey tragedy papa tragedy what tragedy god what tragedy papa papa masio kike is dead masio kike is dead papa is dead hey I told you, didn't I? Anybody who dares Akrika, dares trouble. In fact, he dares extinction. Yes. <laughs> Papa, you're, you're rejoicing over another man's death. Why shouldn't I? Why should I not? Okeke touched the tiger by the tail, and he has reaped the consequence. <laughs> Papa, it's not right. What you're doing is not just right. Eh? How can you be rejoicing over another man's misfortune? Now you are still a child. You won't understand. Go in and leave me alone. Leave me alone! Papa, it's not right. It's, it's not just right. Mama, I can't see you. Mama, I can't see you. Mama, I can't see you. The fire does uh. work. The fire splitter. Fire producer! Fire on the mountain! Run, oh. run, run! Well, it is well. Yes, Your Highness. We shall do it that way and make sure that it does not harm the community. It will, I am sure nobody will be hurt. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? I don't know, Your Highness. She just ran past me. can't say the word. I have to follow her here. My daughter, what's the matter? Papa. <laughs> Masokeke. Masokeke is dead. What? He's not in the fire and died. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Hey! Oh. Oh. Your Highness. Please go straight to Okeke's house and find out what is happening there. Yes, Your Highness. Then bring what's back to me. Yes, Your Highness. Lola, take your daughter back to the room and comfort her. Be yourself. That is the place of time. In fact, we lost a great man. My second in command. It is painful. Really painful, very painful. Oh God. Well, uh, you be may your throne be long. Yes, sir. Man. I greet you, God. Welcome. You're welcome. Now, what can I do for you? Uh, you you can see members of the cabinet are meeting. Sorry to come up to this meeting. But the presence of the members of the cabinet is also good. What I want to tell this cabinet is that it was Agrika who killed my husband. Agrika Aro! Woman, this is a very serious allegation against a member of this cabinet. Agrika, you said. I have my evidence. Bring up your evidence. Bring them up. I will, my husband. Eh? What an insult! I don't know, sir. Who are you talking I insulted my husband. You were Africa threatened to kill my husband because of that plan at Ophianta. And he has fulfilled it. He has just fulfilled it. Why? The land at Ophianta was given to Mazio Keke by members of this cabinet. Yes. Then why should Akrika, why should you put your eyes into it? Even this is an insult. I have no sense. And I will sit here and watch people mess up my name. Akrika, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Akrika, don't walk out on us. You've all seen it. Oh. Now, if I may ask again. Are you sure of what you've just told members of this cabinet? That you are prepared to defend it any time, any day? Igwe, 
I have my evidence. Bring them up. I will, my husband. Eh? Me, Agrika. Who is that? Okay, Agrika. Africa. They say that you insulted them by walking out of the meeting. Eh? You shouldn't have walked out on the entire cabinet. It's wrong. I walked out because I was angry. <laughs> yes. But it was a very big mistake. A very, very big mistake. Now, they have concluded plans to suspend you from the council until you apologize to them. Apologize what? Over my grave! Akrika, you will do that. Move up, Akrika Chioko. Bam. Akrika, a man can never fight the public. There is a saying that when a man cooks for the public, they will consume whatever he cooks. <laughs> but if the public cooks for you, you won't be able to finish what they cook for you. You will apologize to them. Emeka, you have weakened my position. I will apologize to the council. But let me tell you, it won't come from my heart. Whether it is from your heart or from your stomach, the important thing is that you will not give the room to suspect that you have a hand in Okeke's death. You will apologize. Okay, okay. I've told you I will apologize. But that woman in there. Move back, I will deal with her. No, 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 no. Nobody should say that. Nobody. I said nobody should. Listen. Nobody is above the law. Yes. And this nobody should be treated as a secret cow by this council. Who is talking about secret cows? Then shut up your mouth. Shut up. <laughs> shut up your mouth. <laughs> Me. Yes. Mazi and Mekan Nana. To shut up? Yes, shut up your mouth. I thought I'm going to get on my other. Oye. You. Oye. Tell you. A whole council member telling me to shut up. Eh? Yes, because you're a stupid and useless error. By the way. How did you? Who brought this man into this council? How did you manage to enter here? Yes, eh? Uh, How did you manage? My father replaced your imbecile father. Papa, you can't even call it. You are just not a fool, but a bloody fool. Stop it, bloody fool. You are a bloody fool. You are very foolish. Stop it, both of you. I said, stop it, both of you. I said, stop it, both of you. What is this madness? This man is mad. He comes in their family. He's a poor hero. Poor hero. Let me say that this council will not tolerate any act of indiscipline again from its members. Yes, will. Last time, Akrika insulted this council by walking out on us. Yes. However, I said it. I've called this meeting to sanction him. Exactly. Exactly. Nobody is above the law. And it is only the Igwe that has a final say in this community. Sit down, Kako. Sit up. down. Igwe has not asked for your comments. Sit down. Igwe has not asked for your opinion. Sit down. Okay. Igwe is the only person who has a final say. Sit down. I said sit down. Igwe. 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 Mazi Emeka Nana. I'm beginning to wonder whether you have some interest in this matter. He has. Yes, he has. Uh -uh. Why have you become so vehement in defending Africa? Oh. Uh, let me ask you. Has Africa offered you some bribe? Yeah. Fear! <laughs> Don't insult me! To fear! To fear! Listen, a titled man does not eat in the marketplace. Uh, yeah. All I was trying to tell you people is that before you kill a man, hear him out. Hear him! Uh, 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 Emeka. Haven't we given Agrika enough time to appear this before this council oh. and defend himself? Mm -hmm. What else do you want us to do mm -hmm. as sure. so that he will be heard? Yeah. Maybe he wants us to send a, a delegation or buy cakes or pan wine. Look, Igwe, if Agrika refuses to appear here before the council, we will take it that he is guilty as Accused. Aleka, sit down. A man cannot be bigger than a town. Mm. No. Akraka is just one man mm. whose absence from the market 
is not significant at all. At all. Oh. If he's taking a battle stance against us, yes. <laughs> against us, <Uzawa, laughs> then we are ready for him. Yes. Let him fight. <laughs> May your reign be long. I want to say that I'm highly angered against this council. Hey, hey, good. Good. And I would hide it. Africa, why are you angry with the council? Yes. You were the one who offended this council by walking out on it. Here you are again complaining. This is a typical case of the millipede and the man who stepped on it. The millipede calls in pain. Why the man who stepped on it shouts and runs around making noise. I thought you are here to tender an unreserved apology for your behavior. And if it is not why you are here, I will advise you leave us. Of course. He hasn't come to that. No, no. No. When a child misbehaves, a responsible father corrects him. Yes. Uh, In fact, I actually came here to apologize to this council. No, no, no. Eh? No, no, no. It was anger that made me do what I did. No, yes. it was. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm bad. Yeah, right. 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 When a man uh, offends his people, uh, just like you've done and tenders an apology, definitely he will be pardoned. Yes. Yes. But that is not all. Are you now prepared to answer the charges leveled against you by Ne? Okay, guess why? Good question. That woman is accusing me falsely, without basis. Eh? Falsely, Akreka. What is falsely? The two men who were with you in the farm on that day that you threatened to kill Okeke, okay, are there to testify against you? I did not kill Okeke. Okay, okay. Why should I kill him? Why? Akreka, are you now set to face the young men who were there the day you threatened Okeke okay, okay, and who have ample evidence against you? I am set, but I must be given time. It's all right. Uh, Take seven days. Will that be okay with you? It's okay with me. It's okay. It's all right. It's okay. Um, this cabinet will rise till the next seven market days. I'm sure very soon they start looking for your wife. He knows how to get married to. And you'll still be here. <laughs> Uh, Princess Ego, what an honor. What honor? Um, Princess, don't you know you are an ego? And no one size the ego carelessly. I'm privileged. I'm flattered. Uh, what did you have was school today? School? <laughs> so so, it was good. Only that students are getting wilder by the day. You should know how to handle them. Are you not a professional? A teacher? You should know how to handle them. Tame them. Uh, Akuna, we are trying our best. Huh? Uh, princess, thank you so much for the privilege of sharing your time. You're welcome. Uh, I'll be on my way. All right. Watch your back. Okay. <laughs> He is gentle, not like his father. Ah. Don't be deceived by his greetings. Or, or have you not heard of the adage in her woman? The offspring of a snake cannot but be long. Um, you don't conclude about people like that. Until you get close to someone, you can never know his true nature. Are you falling for what it is? Well, <laughs> if he has the ability to catch me when I fall, then, <clears throat> um, um, who knows? 
<laughs> you forget you're a princess. And it is not just any man that is qualified to catch you. <laughs> How come? No, you always say your own. Well, I've heard you. Okay. Let's wait till then, till I'm ready to fall. Okay. Right now, so I'm not falling yet. Okay. <laughs> so these people are bent on doing me in. Huh? No problem. Oh, what are these who's our? This is our who's our? Huh? We shall see who is who. We shall see. Now, who shall see? He who chases after the little chick must surely fall mm -hmm. and smear his hand on the sand. It's true. The Igwe and his allies are planning my downfall. They can't. They won't. Now, they are just bragging. Yes. <laughs> are you not Akrika? Akrika no, Choko! Hey! <laughs> they won't succeed. They will never succeed. You will never lose sleep because of them. They will fail. They will fail. They will fail. They will fail. In fact, they have failed already. Oh, I can't have Jack. Moye, come and share in this room. <laughs> come and share. They have failed. Fail, failer, fillest. Huh? Hey. Mumabari Katsyoko. The fire eater. The fire spitter. The fire consumer. Fire on the mountain! People are not happy over Major Keke's death. And our inability to unravel the mystery of his death. Um, Igwe, we already know the killers of Okeke. It's just a matter of time. Just seven market days and uh, the killers will be exposed. Africa you are. Is it Africa? That man is bent on denying all allegations against him. Deny what? He, yes, now. Can he deny? He can't. That there are odds against him. Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. My daughter, what is it? Why are you looking so harassed? Uh, Papa, terrible things are happening. Like what? So people found Apo and Ndu dead near the river. What? Ndu and Apo dead near the river. God forbid! Okoha, are they your brothers? No, you are hiding so... Hey! Then why are you shouting and looking so uncomfortable? Those were the two young men who were with Okeke on the farmland that very day Akrika threatened to kill him! You mean they are the ones who are supposed to testify against uh, uh, Akrika on this matter? Yes, your highness, but now they have been murdered. Uh, uh, are you suspecting Akrika for the act? Yes, would have done that. If not, I can go back to tracks. Hmm. But you, you have no evidence against him. They had already spoken with the two young men. Mm -hmm. And they promised to testify against Akrika when the case comes up. And now, they have been murdered. Chief! They cannot anymore. If it may be good, oh. things are spoiled. Oh. Yes, my brother, I want to cook plate dinner. Yes. Give me the vegetable. Take the fish, go inside and remove the bones. Just hurry up and come now. Yes, ma'am. Because also. Also, I come now, also. Take the fish inside and remove the bones. Hurry up. Anyone else? Who is that? Pastor Jim. Mary, peace of the Lord be upon you, Madam Okeke. Amen. Pastor James, yeah. this kind of visit. Oh. Uh, no problem. I have come to deliver an important message from God to you. Hey, yeah. Let me get your seat to sit down. Akuna! Bring seat for Pastor James. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. No. Pastor James, you're welcome. Yeah, thank you. How are you today? I'm fine. Hmm. Hey! <clears throat> Pastor, look. No. Yeah. Uh, Madam. Pastor. You know, since I returned to this community, I have been steadfast in telling everybody that cares to hear about Jesus Christ. Yes, now. Everybody knows about you in this community. Yes. But there's a lot of evil going on here. I mean, people's hearts are not clean. That's true, Pastor. 
Just like they killed my husband and made me a widow. Yet they are planning great evil against you. Unless you enter into Christ, they will get you. God forbid. God does not forbid just like that. Unless you hide yourself in him. The book of Proverbs chapter 18 verse 10 says, The name of the Lord is a strong tower, and the righteous run into it, and they are saved. So you must accept Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. Then he will protect you. Pastor, I want him. Please pray for me. Good, good. But before I pray for you and lead you to Christ, let me tell you that it has been revealed to me that you are planning to go and walk on a piece of land in North Yanta. Is it true? Yes, Pastor. But that land belongs to my husband. It was given to my husband when he became the second in command to the Igwe, before he died. Blessed be the name of the Lord, who does not leave his servant in darkness as to the plan of the wicked one. Madam. Yes, Pastor. That land is being contested for in the spirit realm. Had you entered there before this my mission, the same thing that killed your husband will have killed you. God forbid. Chikuachu. Pastor, but that land belongs to my husband now. Eh? Okay, we here in Kanua. Yes, but wicked ones don't want you to enjoy it. But not to worry. After giving your life to Christ today, we will pray and cancel every evil force on that land. Amen. I will go there personally and remove whatever thing the devil has planted there. Because Jesus made it clear in the book of Matthew chapter 15 verse 13 that whatever plant which is not planted by our Father in heaven must be rooted out. Amen. Amen. Stand up, let me lead you to Christ. Akuna! Akuna, be happy, Akum! You will repeat these things after me as if it comes from your heart. It's a spiritual thing. God knows when you are serious. Say after me Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. I come to you as a sinner. I come to you as a sinner. I come to you because I cannot save myself. I come to you because I cannot save myself. Hallelujah! Jesus conquered the world. Hallelujah! Set on you are in trouble. My love and is in my life today. Hallelujah! Jesus conquered the world. Hallelujah! Set on you are defeated. My love. Today, hallelujah. hallelujah, Jesus conquered the world. Hallelujah, Satan, you are defeated. My Lord reigns in my life today. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Jesus conquered the world. Hallelujah, Satan, you are defeated. The Lord reigns in my life today. In Jesus' name, Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Mighty Jehovah, today is a day you have made. A day for your daughter to possess her possession. Amen. Father, Luke chapter 10 verse 19, that uh, you give us power to tread on serpents and scorpions and uh, nothing by any means shall hurt us. Therefore, whatever been the thing, the forces of darkness that is in operation in this land, I tread upon it in Jesus' name. Amen. I nullify it in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, you also made it clear. In Matthew chapter 15 verse 13, you say, any plant which is not planted by my Father in heaven must be rooted out. Amen. Therefore, every crosses, every vexes, every hexes that has been planted on this land as a servant of the Most High God, I root them out in Jesus' name. Amen. I root them out in Jesus' Amen. name. I cover this farm with the precious blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. I cover it with the blood of Jesus. Blood of Thank Jesus. you, Jesus, Thank for you, you have done it. Amen. Blessed be your holy name. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Amen. Blessed. Been a plan. We have destroyed it. We have destroyed it. Thank 
come and see. Come and see. This is what killed your husband and would have killed you. But God in his infinite mercy did not allow it to happen. Blessed be his name forever. You see, so not to worry, it is no longer potent. I am going to destroy finally. It is the will of God that you possess your possession. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us go. playing on that of Yanta farmland. Never was there with the daughter. So that one is an enemy too? Ah. I see. <laughs> I will give them a full dose of my anger. That's why we are friends. Thank you very much. Emeka, you are a friend indeed. You have tried, eh? A laborer will be deserving a very good wage. I promise you. Eh? At the right time, you will be rewarded. Thank you very much. That's why we are friends. Thank you very much. But that man, you will be. That one that looks like a, an English habit. Hey, hey. <laughs> American. That, that, that featherweight. <laughs> that featherweight. <laughs> hey. Aquamo. Aquamo back to your Papa. Uh -huh. Papa, I, I've told you to give up this lifestyle. It won't take you anywhere. Papa, is it not better to, to live in peace with people than to be stigmatized amongst them? Oh, go now, Father. Let me ask you. If somebody takes what belongs to you and gives it to another person, what do you do? Surrender and go just like that? Papa, there are civil procedures. And not the way you do it. Definitely not the way you do it, Papa. You are not talking like my son. You are talking like one of the combats of that boy that calls himself Pastor James. And that boy, I'll give him a gift. Do you know the gift? Evu, Bala Mada Allah. The bee that stings one to madness. That boy. But, but, but Papa, you have to listen to me. I, Let I, me tell I you. don't. Go and talk to me no more. You are a man. Go and live your own life. Let me live my own. After what, what I'm doing, I'm doing for your sake. Me? How? Okay. Eh? That land I've been fighting for. Who will possess it after I'm gone? Is it not you? Tell me. Papa, I don't want any possession that is garnished with human blood. I don't want it. Ah. I don't. Ubenna, let me tell you. Anybody who is not for me is against me. And anybody who is against me must be dealt with. Okwamuwa, Bakrika Chioko, fire producer, fire extinguisher, fire on the mountain. The death of Okeke and the two young men who worked on his farm is a bad omen for Uzawa. We've had cases of rape in this community where I am the Igwe. Our people say that an elder does not stay at home and watch the good deliver with a rope on its neck. If we keep quiet, the people will lose confidence in us. So, I have decided to put up a strict law against anybody who commits murder or rape in Uzawa. Such crime attracts death sentence. Exactly, exactly. Thank you very much. We are in total support of it. So, I will detail the town crier to go around and tell the people of Uzawa about this new law. Each of you should go home and tell your people about it too. Amen. Igwe. Yes, please. May you live long. You say. Igwe, I have a question to ask. Please go ahead. Let us hear you. Why is it that 
you did not consult any of us, your cabinet member, before coming up with this, your new law. Hmm. Why? What sort of question is that supposed to mean? Eh? Why are you asking that question? Who called her? Did I ask you? Why don't you shut up your dirty mouth? Africa, mind your language. Mind your language. This man did not insult you. We are all elders. It was, this Ukoha has been prognosing into my affairs for a long time. Why? It's because you are an evil man. That's why I put my nose in your affairs. You are an evil man. Did, did you hear that, Igwe? Yes. Did you hear that? Akreka, calm down. Calm down? I should calm down when this man is destroying my image in this community. You tell me to calm down? Okay. I can see all of you have ganged up against me. And I won't take it. And I'm walking out. Yeah, uh, Africa, don't walk out on us. You did it once. Don't do it again because the wrath of this throne will be upon you. Let the heavens fall! Hey. <laughs> You can see what it is. You can see that. Akreka is just but one man in this community. If we can't deal with him, then we have failed. We need him. Calm down. Yeah. Easy. But we should be cautious of how we trade with Akreka. Huh? Yes. The small bird that is dancing on the road has its drama somewhere in the bush. The law has been met, and it affects all and sundry. Simple. Africa or no Africa. Bam. I'm worried. And what worries me is, is those two men, Apo and Undu. They were the only two ones who could stand against Africa as witnesses in my mother's case. And now they are dead. They are dead. Akum, <sighs> one thing I know is that no matter how long truth is buried, it is washed up by the tides of time. Yes. If your father died by the hands of a man, that man will never go on his post. Never. Never. Did you hear about the poison that was dug up at the Ophiantha land? No. <laughs> How Pastor James dug up poison at the Ophiantha land? Poison? What kind of poison? He said it was the same poison that was used to kill my father. And if my mother had set foot on that land, that should, should have been killed herself. Ozawa is going far. Very, very upset. Am I not lucky? The sunshine of Ozawa. Princess. Greetings. Ogona, the teacher. Uh, princess, it's like God always brings you my path. And why, why would he do that? Maybe he... Maybe he knows what I have in my heart for you. One sister, as you can see, we are quite busy. I, yes, I, I, I can see that. But I was not talking to the both of you. I will only ask you to give me some time to talk to the princess alone, if you don't mind. Eh? Well, you wait until you see her alone so you can talk to her alone. Uh... I, I couldn't, don't be difficult, okay? I, I want to talk to the princess beg alone. Okay, beg me. Beg me. I, I'm okay, I'm begging you. I, I will even go on my knees. Please. No, 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 no. You don't have to do that. Um, Michael, let's hear him out, okay? Let's hear what you have to say. Uh, princess, uh, it's not like that. What I want to say is for your ears alone. Mm. Very confidential. Now come, just give us a moment, okay? Let me hear him. One moment. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> uh, um, uh, we are alone now, aren't we? Uh, yes, I, I can see we are alone now. 
Um, princess, mm -hmm. uh, do, do you know you're very beautiful? Thank you. Is that all you wanted to say? No, 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 that's not all. I, I, I want you to know that I, I like you very much and, and, uh, and, uh, I, I would want us to get married. Just like that? No, not just like that. If you say yes now, I will now tell my father to go meet your father for the marriage procedures. You have tall dreams, Matitia. I don't hate you, but... But, but what? Your father, he has very bad reputation in Ozawa. But... As you can see, uh, I'm not my father. I'm Ogunna. I'm not Akrika. Okay? I know. But if I accept to marry you, your father becomes my father-in-law. Um, do you want me to disown him? How can you? How can you disown your father because of a woman? No, I, I didn't say so. I... I, I Ugonna. I, I've heard what you said. Okay. I'll think about it and I'll give you an answer. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'll be waiting for your answer, Princess. Princess. Thank All you right. so much. Mm. Uh, Akuna. I've released her all in one piece for you. Thank you for lending her to me. You're welcome. Of You're welcome. Well, Princess. I can't you wanted to see all the new Greetings. Things. Okay. You right. have a nice. Oh. <laughs> Don't fall, okay? So what was it you were up to you? <laughs> well, he said he wants to marry me. <laughs> Okay, Kasu. <laughs> Please stop joking. Stop joking. I'm dead serious. He just proposed to me. <laughs> and what did you say to him? I told him I'll think about it and I'll give him a reply. You think about you? Yeah. You think about what? What he said. Ego, have you forgotten that you're the princess of Usaba? That you're a princess. There is nothing to think about that one. If he wants a wife, he should go and look for a wife from the families of the likes of his father, not you. How come I like him? You like who? Hey. You like Ugonna? Yes. There's nothing to think about that one. What is wrong in marrying um, Ugonna? There is everything wrong in marrying Ugonna. If you marry him now, Akeka, you'll be your father-in-law. Uh -huh. What's wrong in that? So you want your father, the Igwe, to be the in-law of Akeka? How come you started preaching, okay? You How would I preach? It's... Okay, fine. Let's, let's talk about something else. We have more important issues to talk about than to disturb ourselves over Ugonna's issue. Let's talk about your mother, your mother's case. Uh, yes. No, this one has overtaken my mother's case. Let's talk about this one. <laughs> Like a river, like a river, my soul, I go joy. Anybody here? Is anybody here? Yes. Oh, peace of the love, madam. You're welcome. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, yes, I have come to see Mazia Cricket for an important message. Mm. Yes. Okay, let me tell him that he's here. Thank you very much. Glory in my soul, oh, I've got joy in life. Mazakrika, I greet you in the name Keep of the Lord. Keep your greetings to yourself. James, I have heard how you have joined my enemies to plan my downfall. Your downfall? I, I don't understand you. You will understand after I have dealt thoroughly with you. Oh, come on. Akrika, Tioko. Mazakrika, I'm not afraid of traits like yours because he that is in me is greater than he that is in the world 
Anyway, that's by the way. That is not the reason why I'm here. I have only brought you the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ, which says, according to the book of John chapter 3, verse 3, that except a man be born again, he shall not see the kingdom of God. James, James, I warn you to stop disturbing my peace in this our community. Since you return to this our town, Ozawa, peace vanishes into thin air. Mazakre, you know that I'm not the one tampering with your peace. And God forbid that I, the servant of the Lord, shall tamper with anybody's peace. But the Bible makes it clear that there is no peace for the wicked. Oh, you have also come to my house, right under my roof, to dissolve my peace. Wait, 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 wait. Well, I have delivered my message, uh, meditated upon it. No, sir! Tell me to stop at your mouth, you stop my tongue. You are an eye in this house, be like you, sir. Oh, come on. I can get your coat. Two of you, two of us, in this village. More of a record, your coat. Agumo, my son. I don't want you to be bitter against me. I am only a woman. What can I do? Hmm? I'm not happy that you won't be returning back to school after your holidays. <laughs> if your father did not die, oh! we won't be facing this kind of problem. I could not hear he's also affected. But she has made up her mind, so I just. He God still wants me to go to school. Nam. He will arrange it. It's okay. It's okay. <sighs> We should try to blame those who made us fatherless. Hey. If Mama were able, mm. we would have continued with our studies. Mm. Mm. We, should, we should just try to adjust to our new situation and mm. try to survive. We don't feel so bad. Okay? Nah. Mm. Nah. No, don't feel so bad. Okay? I hope you no. understand it. Yes, Mama. Yes. Hey. Mama is okay. Hey. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. I have only two days. I have only two days to first Igwe's cabinet. The only person who has evidence to nail me to put me into big trouble. It's Mazukwa. Ukoa. Ukoa. You know him. I want him out of the way. Out of the way, I want him. <clears throat> Mazi, you don't have any problem. Your wish is our command. Very good. I'm promising you that we will not fail you. Very good. And I want to tell you that you will not see tomorrow. Trust us. Very good. OK. I will keep your money at the usual place after proof of job well done Mazi the usual place yeah. have you failed you before? Um, I'm bad, I'm bad. <laughs> I'm bad. and that's why I'm, I'm, I'm patronizing you Mazi eh? we will not fail you now very good consider it done very good, hmm? very good. Uh, um, I, I see that pantry yeah. uh, the badges are blue uh, uh, I want to come out Mazi, Mazi, go and walk. Mazi, go and do your walk. Abba, take that! Nne, Obi. Awele, what is it? Oko, hai. 
Ukoha is dead. What? Ukoha is dead. How? Yes. He was found dead outside his house this morning. Hey! They have killed him. They have killed him. And he is the only person who has evidence against Agrika. The Igwe has called for an emergency meeting of the expanded cabinet. If nothing is done, ne. Uzaba will be in trouble. Hey! Okay, KD. Why did you allow them to plug you out like this? Okay, K, why? Who will fight for me now? Mama, it is okay. It's okay. It's okay, Mama. It's okay, Mama. It's okay. God will fight for us. Let me run along. Huh? Hey! Okay, okay. 